This video describes the daily deep cleaning process for any public restroom with floor drains. Cleaning should be done at the lowest traffic time, which is generally at night. This allows for air drying. Other times during the day, cleaning can be done on the highest touch surfaces, the highest soil, attracting surfaces and the traffic lanes on the floor. If these procedures are followed daily, there should not be any reason to do restorative cleaning ever. Filling the hand soap reservoirs is step zero since it isn't actually a cleaning activity. And it can be done anytime by any person, not necessarily the cleaner. First, connect the filler head to the quick connect outlet of the hose. Then, turn power switch on. Press key 7, 8 or 9 depending whether you are going to fill the dispenser with the lowest, medium or highest strength hand soap. We recommend medium, 8, in most cases, but lowest for light soil situations and highest where heavy soil is expected. If there is another product in the hose, flush for 3 seconds into a sink. Now, for the fun part. Open the hand soap dispenser, remove the plug or cap, place the filler head into the dispenser as shown, and open the valve to fill the dispenser. Notice that we create practically no foam, so the dispenser can be filled to the brim with no spillage. We do that by making sure we fill either below the liquid level or with the fill tube on the edge of the reservoir so there is no splashing. When it is full, remove the filler head, replace the plug, and close the dispenser. Step 1 is where we do all the dry activities. Start by blocking the doorway using your property's preferred method. 2. Remove obstacles from the counter and floor. 3. Pick up all debris. 4. Dry sweep the floor. 5. Dump trash containers. 6. Restock towels and other supplies. 7. Dust as required. Turn the power switch to on. On the sprayer, select the cone pattern. On the keypad, select toilet bowl cleaner, key 6. Spray each bowl for 2 to 6 seconds. Now select restroom cleaner key 5. Go back and spray the seat and other exterior surfaces as needed. Now, clean the inside and exterior of the bowls with your preferred tools. Don't worry about getting solution on the floor. We will clean the floor last. To clean the urinals, select the cone pattern on the sprayer and restroom cleaner key 5 on the keypad. For the exterior and walls, the lighter duty restroom cleaner, key 4, might be a better choice. This depends on soil levels. Step 3 It's cleaning the urinals. 1. Spray each urinal interior for 2 to 6 seconds. 2. Spray urinal exterior and wall as needed. 3. Scrub as needed with your preferred tools. Often, no scrubbing is required, since the how to solutions are very effective at removing urine. If you can't see any soil there is probably no reason to scrub. 5. Flush each fixture. For the sinks, use the cone spray pattern. On the keypad, select the light duty restroom cleaner, key 4. When you get to the countertop and other surfaces, you might prefer the mist pattern. Step 4 is cleaning the sinks and counters. First, select cone spray. 2. Spray sink interior for 1 to 4 seconds. 3. Lightly spray counters, faucets and walls. 4. Scrub as needed with your preferred tool. 5. Remove excess solution from counter as needed. Step 5 involves the mirror and high-touch objects and surfaces. For these surfaces, we will use the key 3 on the key pad, glass. Cleaner using the mist spray pattern or apply cleaner to a cloth and clean using the damp cloth or use a spray bottle filled with how to cleaner. 2. Quickly apply a light spray to each surface. 3. Scrub with damp cloth. 4. Polish with dry cloth. Never spray directly onto high-voltage electrical devices, such as outlets and light switches. Use a damp cloth only. Select position 1, sanitizer, on the product switch. 3. Lightly apply sanitizer spray to toilets, urinals and surrounding areas. Either spray, or wipe with a wet cloth counters, faucets, doorknobs, and other required surfaces. 5. Dwell time for sanitizer is 30 seconds. Step 7 involves cleaning the floor and lower walls as needed. 
1. On the spray nozzle select flat spray. 2. On the product switch select clean, position 2. 3. Apply quickly, cover entire average restroom in 30 seconds or less. 4. Scrub as needed, particularly the traffic lane. 5. Squeegee to drain. 6. Rinse or sanitize, 30 seconds, as required. This will depend on soil level and your facility's sanitizer requirement. 1. If time allows let restroom air dry. 2. If the restroom must be immediately open to the public, wipe counters, toilet seats and verticals as needed. 3. Squeegee floor, as needed, to facilitate drying.